Hi everyone, we are in Scotland this week to witness the arrival of one of the 17 underground train units that are currently being built in Switzerland by Stadler as part of the renewal of the whole fleet of trains for the Glasgow subway. The train units are delivered by road to the non-operational area that is adjacent to the main subway line where they get reassembled and tested on dedicated test tracks for a number of weeks as well as within the actual subway tunnels themselves during engineering hours outside of passenger operations. Due to their size, the units arrive in two parts through abnormal load transport arrangements and are then unloaded from the articulated lorry down to the actual track via the use of a specially designed ramp. This looks like a straightforward operation at first sight, but it actually requires a lot of experience and professionalism to ensure all personnel involved in the operation are safe and neither the train nor the infrastructure are damaged during the unloading process. The same process is repeated for the other part of the train and they get reconnected together before being switched on for the purpose of testing the relevant onboard systems as well as the line side rail system to verify they all work holistically before the unit can be tested on the subway itself prior to being put into service for the passengers to enjoy.